enjoy this, this is what you do. It's just like sparring, it's just another round of sparring. And you get in there and you do your thing and there's nothing better than getting out there and feeling good and just feeling fit and just letting everything off. And it's like a dance, it's like a dance. I think we're naturals for this channel. We were born to be on TV. So did you have both flies when you fought this Bubank Junior? No, when I fought this Bubank Junior, you know what I fought to come before? On my way out, one I fought, fucking hell, when TV cameras in front of me I fought, there's no going back now. And then, as I was walking out there I thought, this is an opportunity, right? And no matter what happens, whether I win, lose or draw, as long as I don't get stopped, as long as I hate them at some point in the fight, so that people say, you know, you did well with that Bubank boy, that's all I want to do. Obviously I want to beat him, but... I want to put up a good performance, so now that performance is remembered. You know, even when I go out now, like five years ago, people always come up and do my performance against uh, Fishy Rap Junior. And um, also, uh, Nick Blackwell, I can say, look what Nick Blackwell's done. I fought 10 rounds with Nick Blackwell, you know, really close fight with him. Uh, you know, it's about finding names, I think, and how you perform against big names. It doesn't matter how it's all, it's a little bit fucking James and all that. It's about how you perform against the big ones. What's the plan for this season? This season, well, hopefully, my hands. I've been off, uh, as you know, for a while with injury. Um, I've been doing a lot of uh, strength work, so I'm now going to hopefully get my skills a bit rusty with my sparring. Now, hopefully, I'm going to use that strength that I've built. Sorry, thanks for that. Thanks for having us. Respect. King of the Hill TV. Good luck on Saturday.